Last Sunday here at Detroit Golf Club, the John Shippen National Invitational finished with Wyatt Worthington as the 2022 champion. A tournament's goal is to expand upon black representation in the sport of golf. With the win, Wyatt received an exemption into the field for the Rocket Mortgage Classic. And as he just walked up to tell us, a week of organized chaos. We are so happy to have Wyatt joining us live here this week. First of all, thank you. Thank you. Because I know it's been a crazy week for you. For How sure. have you wrapped your head around everything here, considering you played in a PGA Tour event, yeah. and you got to walk with guys that you've watched for years? Uh, well, I haven't been able to wrap my head around. There's a lot to process, and uh, I know when I get home with my family, I'll, uh, I'll definitely debrief and, you know, first take away all the positives um, and kind of just focus on you know things I gotta clean up and and work on but everything at the end of the day it's it's a win-win 31 years old uh, teaching pro you yeah. told me earlier this week you're so proud to represent all of the teaching pros on really across the country yeah. but more so you said Eastside golf is what you're wearing a black owned yeah. golf company here yeah. seeing young black golf fans watching you yeah. representation is something that this tournament's trying to increase and something that you hope changes too yeah uh no you, you're really checking off a lot of boxes you're good at this uh, <laughs> um but no in all seriousness uh it's i feel as though you know me personally uh that there's a whole demographic that uh needs to be invited and welcome into this game and, and that's a, a lack of representation uh in the black community and i can't thank you guys enough and john chippen and rocket mortgage for you know giving me this opportunity but more so getting getting the exposure um, I know I wouldn't be where I am today if I didn't get that exposure seeing Tiger Woods on TV, right? Uh, at the end of the day, we are all products of our environment, and uh, you can only see what you can see. So you guys giving me this exposure, it's, it's doing so much good for the greater good uh, and the bigger picture. We're not giving you anything. You've earned this. That's the beauty of this. Yeah. And the PGA Tour caught an amazing moment between you and Jason Day, all mic'd up, where yeah. he's telling you, you had asked him right away, what, what does Tiger text you about? Yeah. You know, turning your arm and getting your elbow in. Yeah. But there's a story behind Jason Day and you. Yeah, uh, actually, a lot of people don't know that um, when I worked at Merrifield Village, I was a caddy there uh, for the time being, and I caddy for Jason Day. Um, and he was like, I know you. And I was like, I know you. <laughs> he so, recognized you out here. Yeah. Um, yeah, yeah. So uh, for I, first off, you know, Jason Day, I'm a huge I'm a huge golf fan first, even though when we get inside the ropes, we want to compete and win. But just him being an uh, amazing human being and uh, Tony Finau just recognizing me, like, it's it's unbelievable. So An, an easy guy to root for, man. No. Nate Burleson, our friend that used to play for the Lions, I told you, CBS National News this week, he says, that's a guy I'm rooting for as well. Just many of the people that are in your corner and rooting for you to see what's next. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thanks for having me. Wyatt Worthington, the winner of the John Shippen here.